Have you ever wondered how your computer stores files? Then let me explain to you the basics. Maybe you've heard terms like HDD, SSD, or even NVMe. Let's break them down. HDD stands for Hard Disk Drive. It has existed since 1956 and uses one or more magnetic disks to store data. But how do you read or write your last vacation picture? Let's find out. Each disk is divided into thousands of circular tracks. These are split into sectors, and each sector holds hundreds of tiny magnetic regions. The magnetic orientation of each region represents either a zero or a one. Because HDDs rely on moving parts like mechanical arms, they can be pretty slow. When buying an HDD, check its speed as it defines how fast data can be read and written. Of course, it's a bit more complex, but that's the idea. Now, let's talk about SSDs. SSD stands for Solid State Drive and has been around since 1987. Today, SSDs are found in phones, consoles, and most computers. The key principle, data is stored by trapping electrons in memory cells. Imagine multiple tanks filled with water. If the tank is full, it's a 1. If it's empty, it's a 0. By dividing each tank into smaller sections, an SSD can store even more data. Finally, NVMe is just a faster type of SSD. Most SSDs still use the old SATA connection, similar to HDDs. NVMe, however, uses the PCI Express interface. It's like putting your data on a super fast highway instead of a regular road. And quick tip, I recommend installing your operating system on an NVMe drive. But keep in mind that NVMe storage can be expensive. Use a regular SSD for your software and N for static files like photos, audio, text, and videos. Like, share, and subscribe for more tech.